Hello, my name is Donna Marie Cooper O'Boyle, and this is my labor of love, family consecration to Jesus through Mary. And I wrote this book really because I wanted to help to nourish the family's faith and really to protect the family. You can call it the mom in me or the grandmother in me, but I, I know that we need to protect our children and our grandchildren and we can help them to do the consecration with us. So for the ages of seven on up, um, we can aid them in their family consecration to Jesus through Mary. We can do it all together. And um, I stayed true to St. Louis de Montfort's teachings all throughout the book. You'll find um, an 18th century priest's tried and true teachings, uh, which have been used for so long by so many. But I did it in a way to help the family. And I kind of um, deciphered the teachings and put it in a way that the children would understand as well. So you have the teachings for the parents, the teachings for the children, and uh, suggested activities for the family, uh, culminating in a crowning of Mary on the day or sometime near your family consecration. And I want to share with you something very striking that happened during the writing of the book. I love St. Faustina and I've done work uh, on her and on Divine Mercy uh, and I love the message of course so much. But during the writing of this book I happened to come upon St. Faustina's passage in which she said she had an apparition one, one time when children from the ages of 5 to 11, a group of children, visited her and they said you are to defend us from evil and Jesus came in that uh, apparition as well and he looked very distressed and he told her you are to defend them from evil so she prayed so earnestly from that moment forward for the children but then she said that she found out she felt very strongly that prayers were not enough so coming across that passage in her diary during the writing of this book really gave me an extra boost and shot in the arm to continue with the writing of this book to help protect the families. So, you know, consecrating your children and grandchildren to Jesus through Mary is that extra protection that they need. Of course, we pray for them, but we also want to help them get consecrated to Jesus through Mary. So I hope you'll get a chance to take a look at this book and perhaps do the preparation with your family. May God bless you and your family.